welcome to the Even Milk Safety Show. What are we talking about today, Malk? Unsurprisingly, I'm confused again. Um, and this time, I've come across the term residual risk and have no idea what that means. Well, so residual risk is what it sounds like. It's the risk that's left. But what we need to understand first is what is risk? So risk is the probability of harm happening times by the severity of that potential harm. So as you can see, if you've got higher probability of um, coming into contact with the harm or it's a worse injury that you could sustain, then you're going to have a higher risk. Residual risk comes into play once you've taken your um, initial risk, so the risk before you've put anything in place, then you put in your risk reduction measures using your hazard control hierarchy, you put in your risk reduction measures and then you reassess what that risk level is and whatever you have left is your residual risk. So what I'm hearing there is that I need to carry out a risk assessment, use, put in place my risk reduction measures using that hierarchy tone and then do a risk assessment again once I've done that. Yes, so you're assessing your risk before and then after your risk reduction measures are in place to see what your ri residual risk is, your leftover risk. That makes sense. <laughs>